When a mega crane like this one has a job to do in the port of Hamburg, it's anything but every day. We've never used anything as big as this in these kind of water depths or as extensively as we're going to use this one. It's a pioneering premiere. The adjustment work to the shipping channel requires some major digging and the identification of unexploded ordnance plays a key role. Safety first. We meet Christian Jonas. He's responsible for dredging operations at the Hamburg Port Authority. Even for this experienced engineer, the use of this giant crane and the associated multi-tool workpiece is not an everyday event. Very heavy machines in the port of Hamburg, it's a project with a lot of challenges. Before the dredging can begin, the team has to make sure there is no unexploded ordnance. They use cutting-edge technology to scan the working area. It's a bit like panning for gold. You scan the area, hear an echo, then you start to search the area. And if you find something, then you have to try and identify it. Is it gold, in inverted commas, that is, things we have to recover, and we have to make sure that any object is removed from the area we'll be working in. Baugrund entfernt wurden. Sicherheit ist das A und O. Safety is paramount, as it is in all the work we do. And that's why we have to go to this extent to make sure that nobody is endangered. The next step, the mega crane. It's used in conjunction with a massive hydraulic dredger. Also einmal haben wir ja unseren Schwimmkran. First we have our 200 ton floating crane, Baltic Lift, which carries the device. And the main device is the hydraulic dredger with what we call the multi-tool, with which we can re-identify objects. The multi-tool is the high-tech heart of the device to search for, identify and remove objects from beneath the water. The multi-tool is like a high-tech Swiss army knife for the big hydraulic dredger that we can see in the background here. Safety is top priority here. We don't want to endanger the lives of divers, for example, so we're recovering all objects remotely. And that's what the multi-tool can do. The multi-tool combines several tools in one unit. One of them is a big dredger, which can flush out material. Another is a grip with which we can grab hold of objects. And if that object is not some old ordnance, but something like a steel girder, then the multi-tool can remove the objects. The multi-tool was developed specifically for the work to adjust the shipping channel. It's the first time the Hamburg Port Authority has used the technology in the port. A pioneering premier indeed. Port is what we do.